Good afternoon. This is Universal News Media. It is January 26, 2018. Have you taken a picture of the sun lately? Our sun is different nowadays. For example, this pink ball is always at the 3 o'clock position in all photos of the sun taken from Ohio. I haven't taken photos of the sun from other locations recently, so I don't know if the pink ball would be in a different location for, say, those living in Oregon or Switzerland. But for Ohioans, this pink ball is always at the 3 o'clock position of our sun in recent photos. Here is a picture of the sun taken on October 14th last year, 2017. This photo was taken using an old Samsung phone, nothing special. See the pink ball at the 3 o'clock position? Something else I would like you to notice is the odd lens flare containing an orb in the center dotted with lights. Before recent times, the sun lens flare never had this. This dotted orb is a reflection of some equipment that we will touch on briefly in a minute. Another thing to notice in these photos is the prism colors that never existed in older photos of the Sun. Now that you know where the pink ball is located, here is a close-up again, using brightness and contrast to bring out the image better. Here is another Sun photo taken last October 18th at 1.08 p.m. Notice the red ball, the odd lens flare, and the prism colors. This photo is darker because it was almost 5 p.m. when taken last October 19th. Thus, the prism colors are absent. But the red ball and the orb-centered lens flare are still obvious. We know that the pink ball is not a camera anomaly or a lens flare because it never moves. It is always in the same position, no matter how the camera is held. The sun is getting close to the horizon in this photo, taken last November 28th at 3.03 p.m. So the prism colors are subdued. However, the pink ball and strange lens flare are still there. The sun was being chemtrailed on December 19th last year, so the pink ball and prism colors are not showing up. But the lens flare still has that light dotted orb in the center of it. On Christmas Day in 2017, the pink orb and unusual lens flare are present. The prism colors fan out into a starburst on December 31st at 3.03 p.m. The pink ball is easy to see, as well as the light dotted orb in the center of the lens flare. The sun is low in the sky when this photo was taken, this January 18th at 4.39 p.m. This morning, January 26th at 11.25 a.m., this photo was taken. The lens flare contains the light dotted orb, and the pink ball has not moved. These next few photos are close-ups of the center orbs in all of the lens flares that we just reviewed. This is a reflection of a real object, an actual piece of equipment positioned close to the earth in front of the sun. After we go through these close-up pictures, I will show you the same round light dotted orb reflecting upon water surfaces proving it is a real piece of equipment. It is part of a very large lens system that sets in front of the sun but very close to the earth. Here are some photos of the light dotted orb reflecting upon water surfaces. These photos were all taken during an eclipse or a near eclipse. Thus the light dotted orb always looks black. This is the case during an eclipse or a near eclipse. It cannot be seen with the naked eye because of the bright intensity, but just about any camera can see it. In the lower 48 states, the black dot is rarely seen because the sun is heavily chemtrailed during these eclipses and near eclipses.